Hi, it's Teddy. I hope you're doing well. This is um, part two of a two-part series on how to share content through social media. The first video I've already created, it's under the Facebook playlist on my channel. This one is how to share a URL uh, through your LinkedIn profile, LinkedIn groups, and LinkedIn company page. So let me show you how to share an article and do it uh, better and differently than most people are doing. So you can create a greater opportunity for a great engagement and a greater opportunity to be perceived as an authority regarding what you share. So again, I could go um, down to the bottom of any article uh, that uh, has sharing links. I can click the share buttons down here. or uh, But I generally don't do that if I really want to post it differently. What I do is grab the URL, highlight, control C, and then let me go to LinkedIn and paste that URL with uh, either Control V or, or uh, Command V on my Mac, <clears throat> and it resolves to the article with the image. And then I delete the URL up top and I post my editorial. Here is a great article with 16 best practices tips for engaging on Facebook. Again, this is my editorial, why do I want you to read this? Useful to anyone who wants to be a better social engager. Again, an editorial, why should you read this? Now that's the first thing you can do when you post a link. Here's the second thing you can do on, on LinkedIn. Edit the title. And I could write best practices. 16 Facebook engagement tips. That's the second thing I can do. The third thing I have the ability to do when I post a URL to LinkedIn is edit the excerpt. The excerpt usually comes with the article and I can write fabulous read Oh, fabulous read Facebook engagement best practices for creating success from your social media practices so again post the URL uh, Put your editorial in the subject box. You can edit the subject, uh, excuse me, the title, and you can edit the excerpt, and then I can post it. The second thing I want to show you is that when you are sharing a, uh, um, a URL on your company page, so let me go to my company page, Burris Consulting. So again, I got my URL, control V. So on my company page, uh, paste the URL, let it resolve, delete the URL and update it with my editorial. Great read for anyone looking to engage better on Facebook 16 best practices worth reading there's my editorial the second thing I can do is change the headline 16 best practices Facebook engagement tips and the third thing I can do is I can change the excerpt that came from the article. Best practices. Facebook engagement tips that can help you to create success from your social media investment. Now the other thing I can do in a company page is I can also uh, ch change the image that's being displayed or upload an image. And if I go to upload image, I can go to 
grab an image again you're going to want to grab an image that is relevant and specific to this article don't just grab an image that's especially one that's irrelevant again on your company page you can put always put your editorial you can replace the title you can edit the excerpt and you can either choose the image or upload an image that you want to use on your company page and then share that one more tip to share with you is in your groups so let me go to a group and I'm going to use this group here <clears throat> that I'm a member of uh, I'm going to start a discussion I'm going to post or excuse me paste that URL and it resolves again I can replace the uh, or put my editorial great tips for Facebook engagement 16 best practices I can put a little bit more editorial this was a very good read I encourage anyone looking to increase their Facebook engagement to read this article I can also change again change the title 16 best practices for Facebook engagement and lastly I can change the editorial best practices for Facebook engagement if you want to create success from your social media investment read this article and lastly I don't have the ability to upload an image in a group but I have the ability to change which image within that post I'm sharing and then I can share it to the group as well as to Twitter whichever Twitter profile I want and then I can share it so finally for LinkedIn content sharing you should always post the URL put your editorial if it's appropriate and necessary useful edit the title if it's appropriate and useful edit the editorial and where you can such as in the company pages you can up, update upload another image as long as that image is relevant to the article again the intent of all of this is for you to be sharing content through LinkedIn that and share it better than others share it and differently than others share it so that you get seen and perceived as an authority. I hope this was useful.